everybody, it is Kevin Ho, and I am over here at 3944 21st Street. You might remember we had to take the video down uh, out of respect for privacy, which we will always gladly do. We saw the fixer next door, a really big sort of in envelope home. But over here, we've got the Art Deco neighbor. And over there, you have a beautiful house that's being restored right now as we speak, because Collingwood is up that way and 21st keeps going that way. So you're kind of in the border between Diamond Heights and I guess maybe Liberty Hill and the top of Eureka Valley slash Castro. Eh, where are those? One of those things too. Hey, good to see you. I haven't seen you in forever. <laughs> good to see you. So Art Deco exterior, and it is listed with Aviva Kamler at uh, Sotheby's. And you've got this lovely, beautiful, ooh, I love that little hedge material. And you've got the glass um, garage door. You know what? Let's measure this while we have a chance since we're here. So I've got the good measure today, by the way. It is, how many feet wide is that? Eight foot eight wide and the height it is about seven foot six. It's nice. Beware of the little scoop here. Um, you get some ramp angle things. There are people who can do it. Hey, I just sent you something. I saw cool. That. Let me do this and I'll, I'll talk to you about it. But this John Salegi, happy. Um, are you still at Compass? Still yeah, Compass. still Compass. We Good love John. To see you, Good to see you too. Uh, so we're going to walk in. So I love the entrance here. And when you first come in, you know the home is special. Beautiful black store here. Nice. Um, Wood floors looks warranty. Yeah, um, take a look here. Good entrance. Wow, look at that. Look away. So you're getting a first reaction of this home with me because I haven't seen it yet. So, wow. The first thing you oh, look at that. So the first thing you want to do is come outside and see that you do have a peekaboo view of the skyline, and you've got this beautiful. Oh, look at that. And they are real. Now, do they have any scent? I'll do that while you look in this beautiful yard. Great effect here. Look at that. So you've got the glass up there. You've got multiple floors, great windows. You've got a guest room down here, big slider. Nice little concrete retaining wall here. Let's see, I love the little grass in between, so artificial turf, the hardscape ping pong, uh, net and table you've got a nice stone here and then you've got the bedroom now let's see approximately how much of a yard you get oh no that's not it let's see i love measuring things but let's see this is not going to measure it because it is too vague but i think i remember mm -hmm. you know what we're gonna do it the other way around sorry buddy so we will go around here reason why is we just want to see how much of an outdoor space you really have. Outdoor space is so much more important than you think. It's 22 feet, which is great. Oh, and we're losing battery, so I will charge this next time. But nicely to notice here, siding is new. It's the newer material. It's probably a hardy board, which is uh, an improvement uh, to what it could be. You've got the gutter drain. Oh, that's kind of cool, where the, use, um, the water comes down with electrostatic uh, action speakers. And let's go in here. So, lovely. I love the eaves. I love the embedded lights with the slider apertures here. They have great art. Let's see ceiling height. Well, we still have a chance. Seven foot ten. Here is that bedroom. Great furniture. Uh, love the sconces here. Nice big closet. Good closet. And then good hefty doors. They're solid. This part is laundry. Nice laundry with a laundry sink. Ooh, over here, you've got, ooh, that's really cool. Nice LED mirror, in-wall tap, curbless into the shower with lots of tile. Let me see if I can turn on the light. There you go. Nice niche, a little uh, up there, linear drain, and you turn on the shower here so you don't have to get cold and wet. Nice stacked marble uh, tile as well. And then I suspect this is the garage. Oh, look at that. So that's lovely. Lots of storage. You guys look at the storage first. I look at the foundation, concrete. It looks really good. You've got your Tesla charger there. You've got your mechanicals, solar up there, the inverter, 
and then you've got various home automation technologies and you have central vacuum it looks like and then you've got your forced air and your big water heater that looks like it was just replaced in february so coming in through the house let's go upstairs this is just the foundation part of the, the ground i love that view let's see what the rest looks like So coming in through here, let's look up from the open stairs. You got this. Run that gimbal. Oh, you have a gimbal too. Oh, hey girl. <laughs> <laughs> the gimbal. So you're doing vertical. I'm doing horizontal. I see. You, you too. I don't do. I do mine on TikTok. Oh, the talk of the tick. I try to do that. I'm so confused. I feel like so like dinosaurish. You know, for not they've doing. They've done. They've done well. They have done well. Like six minutes, seven minute videos on TikTok. There's six minutes. Oh, I thought you think it was like 40, 000, seconds. Fifty thousand. Oh, really? I'm gonna have you to. Are? I will have to borrow that into it. So, that's a new thing, right? So you've got built-in shelves here. You've got the uh, nice casement windows. Beautiful thing here. I love the Nelson uh, light you've got, and ceiling heights on this level. So do you produce the videos or do you just cut them and splice them or use their editor nine feet in here? What do you mean? Like, you know, the clips, cause like mine are usually like 10 minutes long. Sorry everybody, we're doing industry talk. <laughs> it's usually like 10 minutes long. And then like, I'm like, well, sometimes it's too long for the, ooh, look at that. Like, would so, you say, look at the bathroom and have little labels coming up too, or? Cause I just walk through just. No, so I walk and talk. Oh yeah, just, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so, you just yeah. split it if it's too long? Yeah. Oh, maybe I'll just do that. Yeah. Oh, and you, but that's why you're vertical, and I'm. Oh, uh, maybe but in conjunction. Just start doing the uh, horizontal. See my my ones that I do on YouTube. I right. do every video. Ah, uh, yeah, I do that. We do that too for the thing. So, huh? Cool. You know, I just noticed how amazing this art is. The whole thing, all the art and the design, is great. The we'll talk. Send yes. me a bang. Yeah. He's yeah, like, we'll yeah. Thank you. So, more industry talk here. Ooh, I like this little alcove here but i love the landscaping the views and you've got the see how important the hardware is there where it just shines the um uh the uh hinges because hey alec how are you Hello. good to see you you're good to so in here look at that oh i like that i really do like that so you've got that oh look at that love the tile love that is amazing that's such good Oh, pantry here. Oh, nice. And then, aha. They have a design sense to say that it's, oh, look at that. That is so pretty. Wow. And then over here, and their sandwiches, which is even prettier. Wow. They love design, don't they? It's like everything's so perfect. I didn't do it, but they have great taste. Yeah, I saw all the um, Herman Miller and whatnot too. Yeah, and then exactly. you've got. This nice angles. Let's see if we get the light here. Lamps. Ooh, Ooh. look at that. Ooh, look at that. And you've got your uh, 48 inch uh, Thermidor. I like the sinks, the hot water, the soap dispenser, and the air cap. Four little buttons. I like how there's a little patina there. Little things for vegetables. And yeah, I do talk a lot, right? Like <laughs> your wine fridge and your Thermidor uh, microwave. I really like that. It's a nice contemporary feel. I like the slab that it's nice and thick. It's the mold nose here. And then you've got that going up and then the detailing, this edge right here at the metal, really just nicely done. Beautiful lamps above and then your fireplace. Also that same light motif of just angular, simple, elegant. Ooh, it's a little hammered. And then again, the metal framing around it. Details, details, details. Love the art as well. So let's go up here. And mm. yay, we're gonna have fun. So you'll go. be upstairs while I'm downstairs. Nice oak handrail. And then you've got your tall skylights above. You've got your frosted glass here. So I love these little um, stair treads too. And you've got a nice tall ceiling here. Ooh, hello. hello. Sorry for disturbing you. <laughs> Wow, look at that. Oh, dear goodness me, look at this. Wow. I didn't think it'd be this nice. So yes, yeah, so you're getting first reactions, as you can see. Love the extra thing. Uh-huh. This is just like our toilet, almost. You've got the Toto in, uh, you know, the Japanese style with the uh, power bidet. So nothing like a heated seat to wake up in the morning. Remote control. 
gigantic soaking tub, and you've got a nice skylight above with speakers, back fan there, dual vanity. Let's see how tall the ceiling is in this room. Nine foot ten. Hello, how do you do? <laughs> I'm, in, I'm in her shot apparently. Then you've got your Roburn uh, slider, uh, medicine cabinet, beautiful here. Let me go try that. And then your shower, which you've got your steam shower down there. You can see the nozzle outlets, the hand shower, and the, um, yeah, just a really great effect. So going through there, there's this very nice stacked look. And then you've got your heated floors and then your curbless entry. That's really nice. And then this is a pivot point with concealed um, hinges going through to the bedroom. Wow, I love the wallpaper. You've got smart home controls. You've got the big view. Take a look at that. So that is why these houses are sought after. The view location's not too bad either. You've got obviously the skyline, the cash store is all right before you, and then you've got the upper side of Eureka Heights. This is the greenhouse we were just over, and of course we were just smelling the flowers there. Really, just something special. So I really like the uh, tray ceiling up there, and then you've got your wallpaper, nice curtain rod embedded into the ceiling, always a good touch. Notice how nice the entrance is. It's nice and thick, so you've got that sense of volume and space. It's also functional because it's your closet. Lots of closet space. And then again, back to this side is your patio. You can go out this way. And oh, no, no, I'll just go around you. <laughs> you've got a nice office. Wow, look at that built in. If it's your art, I love it. <laughs> I'm just helping out. It's all the owners. Oh, good, good. Okay, good. Oh, and there's the front porch, too. Look at this. Roses, roses, really roses here. And then your view of your neighbors. Backside of Collingwood, it keeps going that way. And Diamond is over there. And of course, Castro goes up that way. And um, yeah, just really special. I think it's a, oh, oh, ensuite here too. There you go, another modern bathroom with the hex. And the nice, it's really just nice having that sort of, thank you, geometric shape where you've got the flat surfaces that allows the art, look at that, to be amazing. And look at that, even more amazing. Just art is a hard thing to do really well, and these people have done a great job of it too. Yeah, thank you so much. I love it. It's so good. It's thank good to see you. So You're welcome. It's such a lovely home. Yeah. All right. We will talk to you all soon. Thank you. It's Kevin Ho. Be sure to like and subscribe. We'll talk to you soon.